Hello, people of God, children of Israel. This is fire, the holy fire, a.k.a. the fire that came to take the second world down. And I'm back with another video. Um, this is going to be part two of um, the video that I um, started the other day um, that was titled, It's Not Real, But Get Ready. Um, I'm new to making, um, these type of videos on YouTube and everything. So, you know, I be trying to say what I have to say in a, in a timely fashion. And then what ends up happening is I'll end the video and then I haven't said all that needs to be said sometimes. So, um, I, um have kind of examined myself and I seen that that's what's been going on. So for now on, I'm not ending a video until I feel like everything was said. Um or you know, um uh the Holy Spirit has finished working through me. Um and that right there, like, I'm always going to let the Holy Spirit lead me and guide me. I'm never going to end nothing. Um, that's one thing I don't do is um, quench the Holy Spirit. But I have been, like, trying to make the videos in, in a timely in a tim timely fashion. And so I've been to cut it off and didn't finish saying um, some important things. So anyway, um the 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 other things that I needed to um, get across to you all is that um and these are very important things um um first of all a few years ago I want to say maybe one two years ago God was um telling me to let them know um, and when I say them, I'm speaking of the, the wicked ones that's at the top of this pyramid, this Pharaoh pyramid, this Pharaoh system, um, that are running this world, but not ruling this world. Okay. <laughs> they run it, but they don't rule it. So, um, God was telling me that, tell them it's, this is judgment. I'm passing judgment. It's judgment time. And that surprised me because all, all of the years that um, God has been um, using me to prophesy, he has never spoken about judgment. So I was just like, yes, you know what I mean? Because I've been waiting for him to pass judgment on them because of all of the wicked, you know, that they have done in this world and caused in this world, you know. So, um... Uh, so, yeah, so that happened uh, to me. God spoke to me about one or two years ago or so and, and, and told me to prophesy to them that, you know, it's judgment time. So um, then he led me to scriptures in the Bible um, to let them know that, you know, um, things would be happening. You know what I mean? He's passing judgment and, you know, um, things would be happening um, plagues and, and, and certain things like that. Um, whew, it's, it's a lot. So I'm just trying to keep it at, you know, to what I need to tell y'all for now, because it's a lot. So, um, anyway, so, Along with that came visions and 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 God showing me things. Okay. And God was showing me that it's gonna be like a blackout. And this has already happened, which made me so happy to know that. First of all, I know God don't never lie. He never tells me a lie. But, you know, sometimes you, you wonder, you second guess yourself. Just sometimes um, when you're a prophet, you'd be like, um, did God really tell me that, you know? Or, you know, so when you really start seeing it, you know, you, you get excited because that just lets you know just even more how real your God is. 
and 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 especially when it's something that you've been looking forward to as well you know because they've been doing like i said so much wicked so much evil for so long that i feel like i'm just ready for god to give it to him you know what i mean so um yeah so god was showing me that um that it's going to be a blackout it's going to be a great blackout and they have already started this um, over in California. I believe it was two weeks, a couple of months ago. Um, you can look this up where there was a blackout. Um, the, the people had no electricity, no power uh, for about two weeks. And um, that's just that's just the start of things, ladies and gentlemen, sisters and brothers in, in Christ and in, in Jesus. That's just the start of things. Like, it's going to come to a point when... Those lights go out and they never come back on. So we need to be ready for that. That's what this message is all about. We need to be ready. And that's why I'm here to let you all know what was shared to me um, by, by, by my God. And um, um. Also, like I said, it has already been proven. It has already happened. Um, so I'm just like forewarning y'all to get ready. You know what I mean? Um, it's going to come a time to where, and they already working on this as well, to where we going to have to search for our own food and water. We're going to have to know how to purify our own water. We're going to need to know how to go out there and garden and, and um make uh not make but you know um grow our own crops fruits and vegetables um you know if you eat meat then you know you may want to learn how to kill and skin an animal me i don't plan on doing that but i do plan on um you know growing my own crops which i have already been doing um i um had a garden in my backyard, but I have to get it again because, long story short, I had let someone cut my backyard, and they they cut right through my garden. Um, it hurt me so bad to my heart. I couldn't believe, like, you couldn't see that I had a garden there. But anyway, so um, I have to start my garden back up, and I will do that. And I've been doing this. Um, I started this, I want to say... Um, 2015 um i started learning about how to grow my own crops and everything so you know that is what i would recommend you know you all be doing um learning how to purify water um get you some books like i got me some survival books read them learn how to survive learn what is a natural antibiotic because the number one thing that will kill people and has in the past is infection it'll kill you quicker than being hungry okay because this this moment that you get a cut and 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 it gets infected and you cannot cure that infection that's it that's it and i'm not speaking that over anyone i rebuke that in the name of jesus but i'm just saying so um like i said you're gonna need to learn how to purify your own water know where to look to get a water source um uh learn how to grow your own crops um 